Well, hello, welcome back to another What's New Wednesday. Guess what? I actually went to the shops the other day. Yes, I know, I haven't been for a little while and you've had different content here, but actually that's what What's New Wednesday is about. It could be anything. It could be reviewing something, it could be going to the shops, it could be anything, like a outfits of the week, a try on. Uh, that's the beauty of it. But anyway, I did go to the shops, went to the range with mum the other day. They have started to get Christmas stuff in. Admittedly, it's not as much as I thought there would be, but it's, I mean, it's still September. However, um, as you'll see in the video, they've got pallets of stuff ready, like the Christmas trees and all that kind of thing. So that's coming, but they did have a selection in there. So let's go to the shop. Let's have a look around, see what Christmas bits they've got in the range already. And uh, then join me back and I'll show you what I bought. We are starting to get Christmas in. These are nice, these star candles. Yeah, that is nice. Like a centerpiece. You yeah. put some candles on there. For autumn and winter, you could put... Oh, that's a bit damaged. Yeah. That's nicer. You can put, like, pumpkins on it for now and then put, like, Christmas stuff on there. Don't you just love the contrast? Yeah. Halloween. Christmas. Christmas. <laughs> But it started. It started. I am immediately drawn over here. Bedding. Oh, that's nice. Where treetops glisten. Oh, that's really nice. <laughs> this is unusual, look. Trees made out of pom poms. That's different. Yeah. <laughs> nutcracker bedding, nutcracker cushions. Got all your like your traditional colours here. Oh, these are like like carpet, yeah. carpet old-fashioned cushions. Look at this doggy cushion. Oh, oh, I love that. If you know a dog lover, they've got a little Charlie there. Look. Oh, look, they've got the duvet set to match as well. <laughs> oh, look at this snowman set. With like the fitted sheet as well. That's sweet. What have they got on the ends then? Potpourri. Candles. That's not oh that'd be nice in our bar. This is sweet, I like that. Oh, it lights up as well. I do like that. Oh, this would be sweet. At a hot chocolate station. Oh, we have got Christmas bathroom stuff here. Christmas shower curtains. Toilet seat cover set. Little toothbrush holders. Oh my goodness, you can change your light cord for Christmas. <laughs> Christmas soaps. Oh, I like that actually. Bath mats, hand towels. <laughs> They've always got loads of Christmas crafts at the range. Loads of them. Let's have a little quick swizz through. Oh, these are for advent calendars. If you're doing like homemade advent calendars, we've got stickers. Make your own gonk stocking. Make your own gonk mug. Gingerbread house. Painting. Paint your own Christmas train. They have these every year, colour your own canvas bags. These are always good for little kids at the Christmas table, keeps them occupied. The range is one of my favourite places to get ribbon for any occasion, <laughs> for Christmas, for wrapping birthday presents, Christmas presents, but they always do a really nice selection. We've got Christmas light charms. Huh? Christmas light charms, that's nice for, like, that? for wrapping. Oh, you just put it on, do yeah. you? Yeah. And you play them on. Yeah, all for crafts as well, but they're yeah. sweet. Aha. Uh -huh. They have got some some ribbon. We're starting. Oh, they've got the little packs as well. Your hamper kits. How much are they? Two ninety nine for the small ones. If you want to make hampers for people. 
Oh no, they have got some. Some Christmas ribbon. And also they got Christmas colouring books. Got some card making. Do you know what? Every year I think to myself, maybe I'll I'll do some cross stitch. I used to <laughs> I used to cross stitch years ago. I used to really enjoy it. Oh what are these? Advent DIY advent calendar boxes. I don't know how much they are. <laughs> Guys, I think we've come too early. It's not ready. <laughs> I really thought they'd have a lot of the decorations out already. And we'll venture over there. We have got some rows we can have a have a little look at. Whites and navies. Oh, midnight fantasy, sorry. I do like the navies and the silvers and whites. Oh, I've seen this all over social media. So it's a LED globe, lights up. It's very pretty. Oh, we've got some dusky pinks and purples here. These are cute. Oh, these mint coloured ones are pretty. They go really nice with the purple, actually. That looks sweet as well. Little snow globes. I broke a couple of ours. I need to replace them, really. <laughs> Got gold or bronze and green. These are more like natural looking decorations. I like this tree. This is called an autumn glaze bauble. How pretty is that? Yeah, the toadstools are cute, aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> I think these would be nicer if they clipped on, actually. They're quite big to hang. Or maybe not. Oh, look at these different. wreath holders. Yeah, they are different with the stag at the top. Because nothing says Christmas like Santa on a cow. <laughs> or a Christmas farmyard. <laughs> They've got the ceramic houses, ceramic trees. These are always nice on like a sideboard, aren't they? I quite like that as well. They've got like the rusticy colours. So the whites, like the greens, the little woodland mice. They're sweet. I don't want like to eat these actually. Not bad. One twenty nine. You can't go wrong, can you? You can get friends Christmas wrapping paper. <laughs> really? These are different. Swirl top trees. Yeah, they're quite quirky, aren't they? Oh, I've got like geometric ones here. They're different. Chandeliers are different as well. Yeah. <laughs> We've got the traditional reds and whites and greens and candy canes. I think I might do this kind of colour scheme in the kitchen this year. I kind of miss having like the reds and whites because we, we've got like silver and pinks and golds but I think these are different. I like gingham. Oh, well, they've got the candy cane lollipops and sweeties. Where do you hang these? Right, if you've got one of these, where, where do you hang yours because I can't think of a place where I put it maybe on like a curtain pole I don't, <laughs> I don't know cool. they're quite nice but the dog would have it straight away no the, no he'd be scared of it mum oh yeah he would be <laughs> he would be <laughs> petrified of it yeah <laughs> oh how much is this like set oh I haven't got any prices that's good if you just want like a starter yeah. set of decorations oh these are pretty I think I was drawn in by the gems. Oh, they've got maroons and mm. like, what's that, gold? Yeah. Well, champagne. Like champagne. Champagne. They look quite nice together, don't they? How cute is this gingerbread house that lights up? Do you know what that reminds me of? What? The big yellow teapot. Oh, yeah. It looks like it, doesn't it? 
Oh, we've got some Christmas bunting, some tartan Christmas bunting. I think we're coming to the end now, are we? Yeah, we're at the end now of what they've got out already. I mean, I will come back in a few weeks time when they've got all of the trees on display. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's a planter. And we're back and yeah, we bought a few bits from the range. I don't think there's anything Christmassy in here though. Maybe there's, maybe there's one thing Christmassy. Anyway, got my two, well these are Ikea bags actually, the Ikea reusable bags. Do you know what? I had a comment on a video um, the last time I went to the shops and there, somebody said that they were disappointed that I'd, I'd used like a carrier bag. Do you know what? I try my best <laughs> to take reusable bags with me, but sometimes, I forget. Sometimes I take a different bag and it doesn't have a reusable bag in there, so I just have to buy one for 10p from the shop. Um, I try my best, but I'm only human and I forget sometimes. But I've got my reusable bag today. Anyway, <laughs> let's let's get started and show you what I did. Oh, I did get some Christmas bits. I did, right. You know when you forget what you bought and it's literally been a few days ago? Um, yeah, got some of these got two of these actually uh these are christmas tree sun catches i don't think i showed these on the video but some little arts and crafts for the little ones they're nice little stocking fillers as well or like table things to do at christmas during the holidays for the kids or maybe at the christmas table stuff like that these were like a pound each so i've got a couple of those uh and then i got some of the candy cane stickers I thought they'd be really pretty. I've got some um, glass jars that I'm going to fill with sweets for table presents. And I thought they'd be quite nice to stick on there as well. Uh, and then I've got these. Couldn't resist the Christmas light charms. Purely just for wrapping. Imagine these. Brown paper and some string. They look so pretty. The next thing is we got the wooden slab. I really like this was 4 99 so for a fiver this is definitely a really nice centerpiece that can be used for all occasions now you know i like my seasonal decor so this is going to be good with pumpkins on for autumn but then at christmas some snowy trees on there maybe a candle or two um yeah so this is like an all-rounder really so for 4 99 i didn't think that was bad move on to the next bag um i got some got some craft bits because i'm gonna do some craft stuff this weekend so i got a wooden frame i think this was 2.99 they do these box frames in like this wood they've got white ones they've got black ones but i really like the wood like the rusticness of it so i got that and then i got some ooh, card it's a different color card so i'm going to use like the green the black the orange the like mustardy yellow um is that like mustard yellow yeah so i'm going to use all of the sort of autumnal colors and I'm going to create like a box thing. I haven't quite decided yet. You'll find out in a vlog. Um, so I've got that. I also got some ribbon as well. Some orange ribbon. Autumn plain ribbon. So that was a pound. Uh, and then I got some water bottles that I'm going to customise for the girls. I'm going to give them like a Halloween-y water bottle each. So I'm going to do some ghosts on one. I think I'll do ghosts on this one and pumpkins on this one. Um, so yeah, these were, I think these were like 1.99 each. Uh, something like that. I don't think I've got the receipt actually. No, I haven't. Uh, and then the last two items are foodie items. <laughs> so I got from the Christmas section. They've got the food, Christmas food there, but I didn't film any of it. But I got these for Chris's stocking. He loves these. I don't like them fruit fruit jellies but he loves them so i got him some of those for his stocking and i also got him this for his stocking as well although i'm very tempted to try it now and go and get another bar has anybody seen these quality street collisions indulgent caramel smooth hazelnut and crunchy hazelnut pieces so it's like the purple one and the green triangle in one bar that looks very nice I might have to try that and get him another bar. 
And that's it, that's everything that we got from the range this time around. So a mix of autumn and a little bit of Christmas. Um, but like I say, they're getting started. The trees will be up, the lights will be up, all the displays. Um, so I'll be back at some point. I know this might be a little bit premature for a lot of people, but I don't know, I like, I love Christmas anyway. And I just, it's nice to get ideas. Are they starting it too early now? Let me know in the comments what you think. Is it become too early now? Or do you like that you get a mix of autumn and Christmas, you know, at the same time? Let me know in the comments. But I hope you've enjoyed it anyway, having a look around. And I will see you guys in my next video on Saturday. So take care and I'll see you guys then.